This video demonstrates a lumbar epidural steroid injection using a translaminar approach at the L45 interspace. Place the patient prone on a fluoroscopy table. Prepare and drape the patient in a sterile manner. Identify the L45 interspace using fluoroscopy with the C-arm in an anteroposterior projection. Note the needle placement. Insert a 3.5 inch 22 gauge spinal needle vertically down to the superior end plate of L5 intermittently using fluoroscopy to ensure proper needle position. Advance the needle until contact is made with the upper edge of the inferior lamina at the target interspace, one to two centimeters lateral to the caudal tip of the inferior spinous process under fluoroscopy. Once on the lamina, depending on the size of the patient, anesthetize the lamina and soft tissues with two to three milliliters of 1% preservative-free lidocaine as the spinal needle is withdrawn. Nick the skin with an 18 gauge hypodermic needle. Insert a 3.5 inch 17 gauge TUI epidural needle within the anesthetized soft tissue tract until contact is made with the superior end plate of L5, again using intermittent X-ray guidance to ensure proper needle placement. Once on the lamina, walk the TUI needle off the lamina superiorly and medially onto the ligamentum flavum. At this time, reposition the C-arm in the lateral projection to view the depth of the TUI needle. Using the loss of resistance technique, Advance the TUI needle into the epidural space. When performing the loss of resistance technique, rest one hand on the patient to secure the TUI needle and use the other hand to advance the TUI needle slowly and gently, intermittently applying pressure to the syringe until loss of resistance has been achieved. Once in the epidural, perform space aspiration to ensure that there is no blood or cerebral spinal fluid return. Inject 1.5 milliliters of non-ionic contrast. Obtain a spot x-ray in the lateral projection to document the characteristic epidural flow pattern in the posterior epidural space. Reposition the C-arm in the anteroposterior projection. Obtain a second spot x-ray to document the characteristic epidural flow pattern. Inject a 4 to 5 milliliter solution containing a mixture of 1% preservative-free lidocaine and 40 milligram per milliliter parenteral kenalog slowly into the epidural space. Withdraw the TUI needle, concluding the procedure.